<laughs> okay you guys so if you've actually been wanting to remove wrinkles on your skin or you've actually been you know wanting to look beautiful even without makeup glow really really well and look very very beautiful you are actually at the right video because this is gonna take care of those anti-aging or aging problems on your skin and it will help to remove fine lines also so the very first thing things we're gonna be making use of is okra you guys thumbs up this video and watch to the very end so you could see me apply it onto my face also so what I'm gonna be doing I'm gonna be splitting this okra into tiny pieces and then I'll literally just cut it like this now the aim of doing this is so that I could get the slimeness out of this okra So I'm going to be adding up warm water into this, okay, and then stir it up, then we're going to be keeping it so that we could get, you know, our, um, the sliminess, because I need that slimy, you know, mess out of this okra. So I'll be keeping that aside <coughs> and then again we're going to be making use of cucumber now when it comes to wrinkles you guys you need to go get your cucumber because um, cucumber is one great and amazing you know ingredients that helps so very much in removing wrinkles on the skin rapidly it helps so much to um clear up the skin and make the skin look so beautiful so i'm going to be um blending this or better still let me just create it you guys
So you guys, I'm going to be straining out the juice of my cucumber. I'm also going to be straining out the juice from my um, okra. So again, we're also going to be making some banana. You guys, my banana is so, so ripe. Okay, so you have to make use of very, very ripe banana, just like this one. And again, since I actually put it inside my fridge, so it's looking too ripe, right? So I've been needing just a little of bit. So for this one, I will be blending it because I need it to be very, very smooth. So for the juice, I'm going to be putting in the cucumber and the okra juice into um, my banana and then blend it. My ingredients is set and ready, very, very smooth. So if you want my kind of blender or you're wondering what blender I'm using, I'm using um, silver crest. I'm using silver crest to blend this and it's very, very powerful. So again, I'm going to be putting in my cornstarch. So this is my cornstarch flour. You can actually get it online. You can actually get this online. But that it's online. So I'm gonna be putting just one tablespoon of my cornstarch. And then mix it up really quickly. Well. So I'm gonna be putting in a little bit of my carrot oil into this. If you do not have carrot oil, you can put in your vitamin E oil. It's still very very perfect. We need a, a, a vitamin E oil. Oh. Or oil that contains vitamin A and or E or C that would nourish up your skin so well. So you guys, let's go and apply this onto the skin. All right, you guys. So this is my remedy, and yeah, it's it's been. See, you guys. Some of you guys would have experienced this. This is what it is when you keep your remedy that you've already mixed for some time without applying it it's turned brown up at the upper area that does not mean that it is bad it is not bad i actually put my own inside my refrigerator and so that when i want to apply it okay it could be cool on my skin yeah so this is how it is okay so the first thing you do before using this is that you can wet you have to wet your face okay wet your face with the clean water
now after wetting your face then you apply it okay now the reason for you wetting your face is because um so the the ingredients can get into your skin really really quick okay so that you do not actually stay for so long waiting all right Okay, you guys so after applying this then what you need to do is to give it a scrub all right just scrub it for a little while just very very light do not scrub for too long okay so make sure you actually concentrate on those areas in which you have problem like you are having wrinkles around that you've actually noticed you know concentrate on those areas and scrub okay guys so after that is done then you have to wait for a little while okay before um washing it off at least one minute and for this particular one you can refrigerate it and then use it for like two to three times in a week for a more better 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 result and of course you have to make sure to cover it and so that it does not get too brownish when you want to use it okay so let me clean it off and so that you could see how beautiful this looks this is on my skin okay like you guys <laughs> you can go back and compare my skin before I apply this and after which I've applied it and then you tell me what you think this is beautiful just one use and you're gonna see a whole lot and lots of changes okay thank you guys